Okay, hey, welcome back to Bozzy Callahan's Word of Advice. And in this video today, I'm going to talk about the topic of music. And I'm sure some of you may be wondering, out of any topic that I'm going to talk and give my advice on, why would I talk on the topic of music? And the reason I wanted to talk about this topic is because I think it's fair to say that many, many of us like to listen to music on a regular basis, and we all have our different types of music which we find are really cool to us, and I think a lot of us out there, myself included, we turn to music sometimes whenever we are feeling stressed. Or sometimes we just listen to music when we're feeling happy. And if there's anything I would want to say when we are choosing music to listen to, I would just say be careful about the type of music that you choose to listen to. Because there are some bands and artists out there who put out music albums and songs which have a negative message and some bands and artists put out music when they're trying to describe themselves in a bad mood. I'm sure all of us can think of a song that we listen to whenever we are just feeling really mad and that song has a very mad tone to it. Can any of you think of a song out there that you may listen to that's like the one I'm describing? I'm sure a lot of you can. And I know while it's easy to turn to one type of music, especially when we're stressed, which may have a negative tone and we may not think we'll be affected by it, I would just advise anybody to be careful if they're going if they're going to choose a certain song or album to listen to whenever they're feeling stressed. Because I know when we're stressed we think negatively and sometimes we just get ourselves wrapped up in negative thoughts which can come from mad sounding songs. It may not help. Me, what I like to do these days, I try to listen to more positive sounding songs whether I'm feeling happy or stressed. Because I know if I listen to songs that have a more positive tone to them, the more likely it is that I'll snap back into a good mood a lot quicker than I would if I were to immediately go into listening to a record that has a very angry tone to it. Music can be very powerful. And sometimes a positive song can get to us and make us think positively. And sometimes a negative sounding song can get to us and make us think negatively. And a lot of us out there in the world, myself included, we like to listen to music on a regular basis. I love music, and I always will love music. But if there's anything I could really say about music and if you're listening to it, I would just advise that you be careful about the types of music that you listen to. Because some songs and albums and bands or artists out there record music which does not have a very good tone to it and if we let those negative messages get to us, some of us can end up doing something very stupid. It doesn't have to be something we watch on TV or something we hear from our friends or something that we see our friends do, which can influence us to make a bad mistake. It can be some bad music which can influence us to make a bad mistake over time. And at the same time, positive music can hopefully encourage us to
be in a more relaxed mood and it can decrease the likelihood that we're going to make a bad mistake. So with that, that's just pretty much what I wanted to talk about on this topic because I know music is important to a lot of people and I totally understand that. In the end, I would just advise anybody to be careful about the types of music that they listen to. And with that, this is all the advice that I really have on this topic. I certainly hope the advice I talked about in this video will come in handy. And I certainly hope it will make everybody think a little bit. We'll come back for another word of advice video. See ya!